Hey, what's up, everyone, and welcome to another awful podcast here. I checked out the public freakout uh, com- uh, segment, or I should say uh, the Reddit thing, and there was not much really. The only clip I was going to play, I forgot what it was. It wasn't even that interesting, but uh, not a lot of old clips and stuff. So once, hopefully once it gets good again, I'll start doing that segment again for those of you who miss it. But just to talk about my board week, uh, Monday night I did my open mic. Uh, nine comedians, one audience member. We usually average uh, nine comedians or ten, and two audience members. So only two less people than usual. Not not as good as the last one, but uh, you know I had a good time and stuff. And uh, you saw me put a clip up uh, of the the performance and everything. And uh, you didn't miss out much. Um, and then uh, Wednesday, I went to a park a lot. I was doing a stream, as you guys saw. Then Willie Fritz texted me out of the blue, and he said, uh, "Hey, do you want to, you know?" grab a drink somewhere so we went to cabaret caught up so uh it, there wasn't much to the stream on wednesday i pretty much just would have sat in the park a lot and just did more bullshit you know my streams suck as you guys know and then uh friday night i wanted to go out for those of you who haven't seen my streams or what happened was i i, I ate a late dinner and i, I had uh well i know this is a tales of the poop show but i had a lot of greasy food that day and i got the runs so i put the air conditioner on because i was sweated i kept pooping and then i just fell asleep and the time I got up, it was 10.30, so I went on Worldstar randomly, because I saw a live streamer doing it, and I was like, alright, I'll, I'll fuck around, I won't troll people, but I was fucking around it, so that's why the, the Worldstar stream was up there, it took me like a half an hour to figure out how to stream it and everything, and sign up and everything, and uh, yeah, not much really happened there. And then if you watched the stream yesterday, I pretty much, I, I brought another phone with me, I tried to do two streams at once. I was on YouTube and Twitch at the same time. Uh, I think one person was watching me on both channels, and I was just fucking around. Then I went on the MGTOW channel for a little bit, say hi to those guys. I haven't talked to them for about four or five months. And then that was it. Did about a three-hour stream last night, just sitting in the park a lot. Had a Mike's Hard Lemonade, uh, Blueberry, which I probably won't have again. It wasn't nasty. It was actually good at the beginning, but then as I was drunk, I was like, eh. But it did get me drunk. And, uh... That's about it. I didn't go down to the city this week. I know I said I was going to do a prank call show this week. Hopefully next week I can. I can't promise it. But uh, meantime, that's all. That's my board week. Didn't do as much as I wanted to. Uh, but you know what? Uh, you can't win every week. But folks, uh, I got one week left of data. So next week, I, I can't promise. But there's not many open mics I would really want to check out. So hopefully I might just do more parking lot streams. Or maybe actually go to a restaurant or something. Try to figure something out. Well, that was my board week, you guys. Why don't you top that? Anybody can. Let's get to the odd news. A 53-year-old man in U.S. sets record for pushing up, pushing peanut up mountain using his nose. And that is pretty impressive. That guy must have one hell of a schnoz. A Houston man buys a face mask. Then he wore it to rob the same store clerk. This is a Houston I just read that. Yeah, he's a bit. Yeah, that's like a that, that, that's like a comedy sketch. That's that's actually kind of funny. Uh, not for the people who got robbed. That's terrible. But uh, UK cinema chain offers red-haired people free tickets during heat wave. I think that's discrimination. Even though those Irish bastards do fry in the sun. Uh, Troy police arrest Lyft driver accused of driving drunk with passenger on board. Yeah, I mean they will hire anybody for Lyft or or Uber. You could be uh. A fucking murderer, rapist, they don't care. Oh, she got them fares. A woman claims downstairs neighbor broke through her floor and then pepper sprayed her over noise complaint. Damn, you know, I always wanted to do that. You know, especially in my neighborhood now with all the uh, spiky music going around. It's not a bad idea. A man who feared his wife refused to tell her he had a water bottle stuck in his anus. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yeah, cockfucker. So let's read that again. Man who feared his wife refused to tell her. Uh, so he was scared of his wife. That is something scary to tell your wife, though. Honey, you're not going to believe this. You're going to be mad. What? What did you do now? I got a water bottle stuck in my anus. Oh, Earl. You always do this. That could be a comedy sketch. A bad one, but let's do it. Uh, man files lawsuit against Bass Pro. Uh, Bass Pro. Over a fusion warranty on socks, which claim the last sock you ever need to buy. That's actually funny. The slay yeah, the slogan of the company is you won't have to buy any more socks, but you have to eventually buy socks. He should sue them over that. 
I, I support that lawsuit. Hope he wins. A uh, woman climbs through McDonald's drive thru to make her order to TikTok. Yeah, it was, it was like a white Hispanic lady. You know why it's viral, guys? Because it's not a black woman. This has been done before. I know you go say it. Oh, you always got to make it racist. No, it's true. I've seen at least five or ten videos of a black woman climbing through a drive through to get her order right. But because this time she's not black, everyone's like, see? See? It's not always black women. It's not always black people. It's it. This is a white woman or a Hispanic woman. It's like, okay, but this has been done before. This is hack, folks. Whatever. Uh, Tory MP says snowflakes taking heat wave precautions. Everything wrong with the UK. There's more white people skin cancer uh, stuff there. Um, Filipino woman shows white privilege card instead of license during a acreage traffic stop. Drives away ticket free. I actually saw that. I saw the picture of it, and the, and she took a picture with the cop, and they both laughed. It was a white cop, and um, hey, if that works, then get yourself a white privilege card. The cop was like, "Okay, you can go. This is funny. I'm going to tell my sheriff about this." <laughs> uh, flash mob shoplifters strike an ultra store, and they take sixteen thousand goods. Oh, what's the difference between flash mob, BLM, all that stuff? It's all the same. Ooh, I'm sorry, that that was too based. Nine-year-old driving a Mini Cooper leads troopers on chase in North Carolina. That's fun right there. That kid's got a bright future. He's already baby driver. Hey, I'm on fire here, folks. In my own mind. Uh, escaped emo stops traffic in Houston. It's chased by police. New Windows Media Player app travels back in times, and you can rip CDs. I thought you could always do that. I haven't ripped a CD in a long time. I've just been ripping farts. <laughs> It says, uh, former Banbury area pastor sent the Northampton court after performing sexual acts on a Henry Hoover at church. Is that a vacuum cleaner or is that a boy? I hope Henry Hoover is not a little boy. Because that's, uh, not funny. Chinese ice cream ban goes viral after products don't even melt when blasted with a blowtorch. Hmm. I don't have a joke for that. Uh, a woman says she was banned from flight for called out slut shaman. So some guy was slamming a, sh a slut and she called it out. Uh, a woman was taken off Southwest Airlines flight. Melina said she was defending a woman who was slut shamed for wearing a tank top. A woman who was banned from Southwest, uh, another passenger. But what, what did they say though? She felt all oh, appeared gentrified, orange to new black. It was eight friends just got pulled off. Uh, Pulling that some passengers. A woman's outfit offensive because it's a family company. Did she have big titties or not? That's what I want to know. Because usually what happens is sometimes a woman has big titties or something and it just distracts people and they, and they go crazy. And they go, hey, you gotta, you gotta cover those things up. I'm getting ready to cover my pants here. I don't know. I don't get the answer there. You read it yourself. A uh, woman let God take the wheel on test of faith in Ohio, high-speed Ohio crash, please say. K-T-A-B, I don't know what that stands for. Uh, charges, man lit his camper on fire. Then they faced his own garage that appeared targeted due to a Trump flag. So he lit his camp on fire. So he saw a Trump flag and he lit that made him light his camp on fire? I went to a pizza at all you can eat restaurant. That sounds fun for a live stream. Where is that place? Probably not here. Uh, there's only one pizza hut left. I think it's in Port Richmond, which is about 20 minutes from my house. Pizza Hut. I used to eat that a lot. I used to go there for my birthday when I was a kid. Queer. Uh, Florida woman surprised by uninvited, uninvited iguana in her toilet. Mm. Yeah, every once in a while that happens. Man addicted for trying to sell stolen handwritten lyrics and notes from Hotel California. I hate that song. I mean, if I lived in California, I would like it. BMW makes heated seats an 18 month subscription service again. Woman gives birth at a museum stadium show as band plays Enter the Sandman. That's a fucking cool song. <laughs> it's also a good ECW song. You're hitting the head with a train. Ow! Uh, Indian farmers uh, stream fake pro cricket matches to Russian betters for two weeks. Compete with fake sound effects and professional sound commentator. Colorado Springs man hopes to be fourth person to push a peanut up with his nose. So, we read that before. There's a lot of peanut up the nose. Uh, Russian man arrested under anti-terror law after talking about the philosophy of yoga. Hmm. Woman who gave birth in Jamaica stranded after baby refused entry to UK. As we know from my World Star Hip Hop stream, Jamaican guys do not like to eat the pussy. 
You stick the pussy, you don't lick the pussy. Public cop. Black man forced to cut locks in prisons to use the facility. Yeah, yeah, that's some racist shit right there, man. Yeah. Uh, investigators after ugly man tells authorities he killed his noodling partner. Body found noodling. I don't know what that means. Hamster survives a dark, daring trip to the stratosphere on a fly in blue. That's awesome. That could be a children's movie. Russian mother arrested for selling a newborn baby to pay $3,600 nose job. That's terrible. She sold her baby to get a nose job, you fucking whore. Fuck you, Barbara Story said. Fuck you. Burlington resident creates backyard sex toy display in retaliation by law dispute. Educators no need a long, no, no need a, no longer need a college degree to begin teaching in public schools. Why not? They're shooting up people. Why the fuck do you think you get shot by a fucking little six-year-old? Or whoever. Um, Lebedi- Le- 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 Lebanon looks into banned new Minions film because of evil nun character. We're coming down to the end here, folks. The serious Vampire Slayer kit sells an auction for 15600 bucks. Man gave $13 away to strangers to spread his mom's message. What was that? I love getting blacked. What? No, I just made that up. Uh, some small mother's son free meals to the needy during COVID-19. Saw this man by himself in a waffle house. So I said hello and asked him what he was doing with that money. Uh, what's the message? He said he's giving away. Uh, oh, fuck you. Why? She didn't say I love you. She said love everybody. Oh, oh, yeah. Uh, real Batman battle joke event leads to four arrests at Egypt's Gotham. Okay, guys, that is it. There is no more uh, odd news left. Once again, next week, hopefully some more live streams for the channel. I can't promise a prank call show, but I would like to do one. Anything else that happens, you're seeing. That's it. This is the first, but yet worst comedy podcast. Ah, whatever. Go fuck yourself, Cuffy. <laughs>